Yo, what is going on YouTube? Just wanna check in with you guys. I wanna do a little bit of a video review here. Got a brand new hard drive here. PNY M2 solid state drive, 250 gigabytes. I paid about 30 bucks on Amazon. It wasn't too bad. The reason why I didn't get a bigger hard drive is because I don't know 100% if the reason why this mining rig is giving me problems is because of the hard drive, which is why I said, you know, 30 bucks, it's worth a shot. We're going to give it a go. So we're going to upgrade it. I had a traditional disk drive and, you know, this will really help out boot times. Those are some key factors here about getting an M2 slot is the boot up time, which is when you turn on your computer, they say that it's under, you know, five to 10 seconds, somewhere between there. With this, it would take anywhere from 30 to 45 seconds to boot up because of this drive. The other cool part about having a M2 hard drive is because you will no longer need cords like these to plug into them. Or this right here, I think this is a SATA port, I think. But um, those plug into the motherboard because the hard drive will go right in. So I've already went on ahead and took my screw out, which is this. The slot for this is right here. This is where it's gonna slide in at. So I've never actually installed one of these before, but you know, I figured, hey, document it on the channel, share the information with everybody, and uh, you know, make a cool video out of it. So anyway, let's go on ahead and take this out of the box. All right, so we got it out of the box. Not really a whole lot to this unboxing. It just opens up on the side, but here it is. Look how small it is. Look, there's my finger. Look, this thing's probably only like two inches long, but it's pretty nice looking. I like the color of it, all blue. It's gonna definitely look nice. So, but we're gonna pop this out and then I'm gonna install it into the mining rig. I just wanted to show it to you before we actually install it. It almost kind of looks like a stick of RAM. See, and it has all the information, so. You know, the only bad part about this is, is that I don't have a video on actually showing you guys how to back up your data. That'll be for a future video one day when the time comes. With a mining rig, there's not really a whole lot on here except for an operating system, so I don't keep any personal files. But anyway, let's get this thing installed. So it just slides in. You just slide it right in just like that see how it's sitting up so pardon the dust down in here it's a rig it needs to be clean but as you can see here i have the drive in at like a 30 degree angle and you can see it's up and down it's actually supposed to hang like this and what we're going to do is we're going to screw in this screw right here and then that will finish up holding that down so let me go on ahead and show you guys i'm just going to put the phone right here So basically what you want to do is, I know all you can see is my hand right now, but you want to try and get the screw down into the board and screw it in. And it might take two hands. There we go. So I'm pushing down with this one and coming in from the top. Got it in the screw hole. It looks to be good. Screwed it in. Now let's go on ahead and put a screwdriver in there and finish it up. I don't think you have to tighten this down too much. But just enough to where it's in there. So it looks good. Hopefully you guys can see that okay. There we go. So all I did is I held it down with one finger here and I got it in there. It's kind of a, a small fit because look, I mean, I have all these cards up top and stuff and now we can actually unplug this because I don't have a hard drive hooked up to this anymore. So look at that, one less wire, yippee. So, the next thing that you're gonna need for this, which I'll have another video on this one day, is now you need a operating system, which I have installed on here. 
I'll have to make a separate video for that one day, but I have a Windows 10 operating system on here. So we're gonna plug this in and get Windows 10 installed. All right, so obviously I did something right. We got Windows installing right now. Seems to be installing and going pretty smoothly. I had I had ran into an issue, I didn't record it, but I had to unplug all of these VGA plugins for my graphics cards. I recommend when you're doing a fresh install of Windows, unplug all of your video cards completely. Just make it the basic system. If you have integrated graphics, do that and uh, just let it run from there and then install the drivers and everything. So, so far it's coming along well and we'll document this further on the channel. I'll do another follow-up. I just want to show you guys the install and how it went. It's very easy to install this product. Um, everything populated correctly. I did have to go into the BIOS though. Uh, that is one thing for this specific motherboard. I had to enable the M2 slot. So you may or may not have to do that. I have an older um, motherboard. So sometimes it should auto enable, but that's the only little thing I ran into, but Anyways, guys, it's your boy Endless. Like, comment, subscribe. More videos coming soon. Peace.